Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Willi Morgan. Hm. I can't believe it. This is a colony of Mexican psilocybin, one of the most powerful hallucinogenic mushrooms in the world. Professor Jones showed one of these in class when explaining Aztec rituals. Their sour odor is unmistakable and the conditions for growth seem to be ideal. Humid and lacking sun. Only a strong adrenaline rush can counteract their effect. They're supposed to proliferate only in a few areas in Central America. How did they end up here? I'm also wondering who put these wood barrels here. Shit, so this will be a fun. This is... I'd rather not touch them. This species okay. of mushroom is extremely dangerous. The Mexican psilocybe, even if taken in small doses, causes addiction and induces hallucinations in trance states. I don't want to dive over there. I can't even see the bottom. Okay, ich bin gerade ein bisschen irritiert. It can't be. The hull outline, the colors on the bulkheads, a red nightmare sailed on the sea. Its slender shape induced all to stop and admire it. The historian Jean de Leon described the adventure galley this way. This is it. The adventure galley. Kids ship. Oh, ich habe so viele Orte, wo ich hier Trittleiter. Achso, da kann ich mir nur angucken. Who dares? But but who said that? Who dares board my ship without permission? Who's talking? Are you a ghost? Show yourself. How dare you give orders to me? Only I can give orders. It can't be. I can't believe this. My... my god. Dad? Dad! Dad! Is that really you? I have no sons. I'm the Adventure Galley's captain. My name is only whispered in both the old and new worlds. Some people call me the Scourge of the Seas. I'm William Kidd. Who are you? Uh... Dad, is that really you? Don't be cheeky boy. I already told you that I am the captain, William Kidd, and I have no sons. Are you questioning the word of a captain? Don't you recognize me? It's me, Willie. What tone is this? Boy, remember who you're talking to. I'm Kidd. What happened to you? You're not Kidd. You're Henry. Henry Morgan. Don't you ever mention that name in my presence. Morgan and Blackbeard are the reason my crew and I are here. If it wasn't for their betrayal, right now we'd be the masters of Tortuga. Instead, Morgan and Blackbeard mutinied, hired their own crew and attacked us. But nobody can take possession of William Kidd's treasure. Remember well these two names, because they're the worst enemies of Kidd's crew. Morgan and Blackbeard, what I wouldn't give to meet you face to face. And now, speak plainly. For what reason are you here? Ich verkaufe Kochzubehör, genau. <lacht> ähm. Dad, wake up! I already told you to not call me Dad. My kids are my crew. And you don't seem to be a part of that. Isn't this the way to the rotten teeth? I don't believe you're of an age for that club. <lacht> ja, aber ich will trotzdem die Antwort zum ersten noch hören. I sell cookware, mattresses, and bikes. The quartermaster already stowed our supplies. We don't need anything else. Dad, Captain, I'm the new deckhand you were waiting for. It's about time. You have permission to board and immediately get to work. The bridge needs a clean sweep. Ask the quartermaster to give you everything you need to make this ship shine. I'm going back to my cabin now. I have to plot the route for our next destination. Tortuga is waiting for us. What's happening here? How could Dad still be alive? Why doesn't he recognize me? I better get on the galley right now. I have to get my dad back home. Ja, ich gehe mal davon aus, dass er sich irgendwo den Kopf angestoßen hat. The ship is completely deserted. I guess Dad, or Kid as he now considers himself, is in his cabin to the stern of the ship. Okay, Kanone. 
It's a cannon from the 17th century. Even if I wanted to, I couldn't use it. It hasn't got a wick. What's happening now? I hope it's something important. There are rats inside the magazine. That's the reason you've been brought on, deckhand. Try to earn your daily rations. Anything else? Someone stole the last barrel of grog. What? This is really serious. But the quartermaster can take care of it. Anyway, no less than a hundred lashes with the cat of nine tails for the guilty party. Stealing the grog? The nerve. Anything else? Captain, can you tell me your story? Is this the reason you embarked? I hoped to understand how you ended up here, Dad. I have no time to get angry now. Go back to your duties. You can hear my story from the other members of the crew. Sorry, Captain. I'll leave you to your business. Good. Go back to your duties, deckhand. Hmm. Schwierig. Ein Hut? An old three-cornered hat. I think it belonged to some captain. Or someone from the upper class, anyway. Hä? Der hängt da oben, er nimmt unten irgendwas mit und hat die Sachen. Some well-preserved clothes. Okay, das heißt, ich werde mich wohl umziehen müssen, so wie es aussieht. It doesn't strike me as the best time to start reading treatises on 17th century fashion. It looks like a voodoo doll. Some prankster guest of Kid must have left it here after his stay. Better not touch it. I wouldn't want its curse to remain active on some descendant of the represented person. Okay. Oh, Moment. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I can't take it. I can't take them. I can't reach it. Kann ich mal, ja, das kann ich anmachen, aber es bringt mir wahrscheinlich nichts, ne? I'd only risk ruining it this way. I need this to frame Steve. Hmm. It has lots of uses, but not this one. I don't need it here. I think they can be used in a more useful way. Ja, indem er nochmal einen Klaps auf den Kopf bekommt, habe ich jetzt gedacht. Vielleicht können wir ihn umbringen. I don't think that would work. Uh, I'm not an arsonist. It has lots of uses, but not this one. Hmm. Ja, ich kann ja nur die Karten und das Buch anvisieren, aber... I have to find a better use for them. I have to find a better use for them. I'm not an arsonist. Tja. Dad is seated at the captain's desk. There's a strange smell coming from the cabin. Es kommt ein strenger Geruch aus der Kabine, okay. Müssen wir ihn vielleicht irgendwie da rauslocken mit irgendwas? Ich bin mir nicht sicher. Du sollst... Hallo, du sollst dich umziehen. Geht das nicht? I have to find a better use for them. I have to find a better use for them. Hmm. It doesn't strike me as the best time to start reading treatises on 17th century fashion. Tja. Ach, da kann ich noch runter. Hm. Okay, Kanone, Kleiderpuppe. Vielleicht können wir ihn irgendwie ablenken. It could be a good idea, but not here where nobody can see it. Ja, Ach, according to a chronicle of the period, these wooden mannequins were used to make the crew size appear larger. The fear factor and the number of armed men visible was usually enough to win a battle without even fighting. Somebody carved the name they gave to this mannequin in the wood. Jimbo. So ein Riesending kann er mitnehmen, ne? Aber andere Sachen kann er nicht. Oh, ehrlich jetzt. It would be better to use the stairs. Better not. The ship is docked on this side. There's a risk that the shot could ricochet and cause damage. Ooh. This old sword could come in handy. Maybe I can learn how to handle it. If I'm not mistaken, near my house they just opened a school. The Swordmaster. That should guarantee success. Yuck. 
The hilt is all sticky. Time must have corroded the handle's material. Okay, das sollte auch noch wichtig sein, denke ich mal. It's locked. If, as I suppose, this is the door to the hold, they have surely reinforced it. I obviously need the key to enter. I could ask the captain if he knows where I can find it. It has lots of uses, but not this one. Ich denke, das ist eine Art Dietrich, aber damit geht's auch nicht. Es ist nicht Naja, ich denke mal, dass das mit der Puppe zusammenhängt. Ach so, kann ich das im Inventar? I have to find a better use for them. Kann ich nicht im Inventar machen. Okay. Ähm, aber wo soll ich den hinstellen? Kann man den irgendwo Hier kann man den auch nirgendwo hinstellen, ne? Hm. Doch nicht oben, oder? This old mannequin was used to deceive the enemy. The more mannequins there were, the larger I could use it to distract my dad and enter Aha. his cabin. If I could disguise it as a pirate, I could make it pass for one of kids most bitter enemies. If I'm not mistaken, he named Morgan and Blackbeard earlier. I really see it as a Morgan. <lacht> Wie da hängt. They seem the right size. I don't think there was much variety of measurements on a pirate ship. It's starting to look like a member of the crew. A classy so. touch. The hat makes it look more important. Wenigstens funktioniert das jetzt Let's endlich. try to make it meaner. Discreetly threatening. So, ich hoffe, das reicht. Hm. Mm. What's happening now? I hope it's something important. Captain, there's Morgan on the bridge. Morgan, damn scoundrel. You finally came back for the final showdown. It looked a bit like him, but it's not Morgan. Quartermaster, 100 lashes with a cat of nine tails for whoever organized this joke. Hmm. Anything else? I'll need the key to access the hold. You still aren't an official member of the crew. You must earn this honor. Every new member must get to know the ship and gain the trust of the rest of the crew. I think I already saw everything and talked with everyone. Let's see if this is true of you. Answer these three simple questions. First, name at least one member of the crew, except the captain, that you met on board. Um, Teddy the Bear? Jimbo. Second question. According to which code have the rules of life on board been drafted? Der kleine Prinz. Äh. Grog and other delights? Third and last question. How many battles have we faced until today? 36. I'm sorry. You're not ready yet. The answers are all around you. Hmm. Sorry, Captain. I'll leave you to your business. Good. Go back to your duties, deckhand. Hier so ganz hoch kann man auch nicht, ne? Die Antworten sind um mich herum. It doesn't strike me as the best time to start reading treatises. These are books on dressmaking in the 1600s. Evidently, Kid cared about being up to date on the evolution of European costumes. Or some guest left them during his holiday on the adventure galley. They look like nautical charts, probably routes of the adventure galley. <coughs> Life on the seas, rules and tasks on board a ship by William Kidd. It seems Kidd was writing a treatise. Interesting. Okay. Don Quixote de la Mancha. It's one of the first editions. <coughs> Dad looks busy. He completely got into the role. It looks like a voodoo doll. Some prankster guest of Kid must have left it here after his stay. Better not touch it. I wouldn't want its curse to remain active on some descendant of the represented person. Also was mich ein bisschen wundert ist, dass er gesagt hat, die äh, Antworten sind um ihn rum. Entweder ist das jetzt nur eine Finte, weil er halt denkt, dass da Leute sind. 
Oder das heißt jetzt so viel wie, dass wir hier irgendwo die Antworten finden müssen. It's an amazing ship. And its preservation is practically perfect. I wonder how many secrets it still hides after all this time. The famous Adventure Galley. Rumors say that Kid launched raids in all the seas and that the Adventure Galley was the richest pirate ship around. Hmm. It's Jimbo, but it's still missing something to be credible. Ja, aber was? Das ist die große Frage. Die Kanone. Und hier unten ist auch nichts mehr, wo wir... Ja gut, wenn wir natürlich die Tür aufbrechen könnten, dann vielleicht. Da wäre vielleicht was drin. It's locked. If, as I suppose, this is the door to the hold, they have surely reinforced it. I obviously need the key to enter. I could ask the captain if he knows where I can find it. It's surely the door that leads. It's locked. I have to find the key to enter. I could ask the captain. Ja. I don't think that would work. Glaube ich auch nicht, aber was willst du machen? I don't think that would work. Äh, Moment. I should have a very valid reason to do something like that. It's one of the oldest cannons on the ship. It has probably never been replaced. You can tell by the notches engraved on it. Every notch shows a battle in which it was shot. Eight notches. So, eight battles. An interesting tidbit of information. I guess it's still armed and ready to fire. Ja, geladen und feuerbereit. When it was opened, the cannon could shoot. Why on earth should I leave through this hole? Nein, du sollst sie öffnen. When it was opened, the cannon could shoot. Wenn sie offen wäre, könnte ich schießen. Ja, toll. Ich kann aber doch offenbar schießen. It's a relatively new cannon. Probably after the last battle, Kid replaced the cannons that weren't working anymore. Better not. The ship is docked on this side. There's a risk that the shot could ricochet and cause damage. Er hat aber gesagt, wenn ich... I should have a very valid reason to do something like that. Ja, um ihn abzulenken beispielsweise. I don't need it here. Hm. Ähm, können wir ihm irgendwie den Brief oder sowas geben? Wahrscheinlich nicht, oder erst später. Man kann ja sonst nichts mehr machen. What's happening now? I hope it's something important. Hm. Captain, there's Morgan on the bridge. Morgan, damn scoundrel. You finally came back for the final showdown. It looked a bit like him, but it's not Morgan. Quartermaster, 100 lashes with a cat of nine tails for whoever organized this joke. Anything else? Sorry, Captain. I'll leave you to your business. Good. Go back to your duties, deckhand. Ich gehe jetzt noch mal nach hier vorne. So, vielleicht haben wir hier irgendetwas übersehen. War ja noch was mit dem Brunnen. I don't want to dive over there. It's a natural well formed by the running water. It must be very deep. The water comes from some source upstream. It's fresh water. Das mexikanische. Ach so, das war dieser Pilz, ne? Ach, der Pilz. Der hat sich sicher nicht den Kopf angestoßen, sondern der ist auf Droge, nehme ich mal an. It's a colony of Mexican psilocybe. The Aztecs and Mayans used them to enter a trance during certain sacred rituals. They're extremely powerful hallucinogenic mushrooms. According to some recent studies, they also have an extremely high calorific value. Ja, 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 ja. Hier können wir aber nur noch rausgehen. Okay, also hier ist definitiv nichts. Boah. Ich hasse diese Momente, wenn man dann wirklich so festhängt. 
Hier ist auch nichts mehr, was wir machen können. Das Einzige ist nur noch mit dem zu reden. Aber was ich komisch finde, wir konnten doch eben was aussuchen. What's happening now? I hope it's something important. Wir konnten noch was aussuchen. Äh, morgens auf der Brücke. Oder war das hier bei... I'll need the key to access the hold. You still aren't an official member of the crew. You must earn this honor. Every new hm. member must get to know the ship and gain the trust of the rest of the crew. I think I already saw everything and talked with everyone. Let's see if this is true of you. Answer ah. these three simple questions. First, name at least one member of the crew, except the captain, that you met on board. Ja. Da bleibe ich jetzt mal bei Jimbo. Jimbo. Second question. According to which code have the rules of life on board been drafted? Ah, Moment. War das eben auch hier drin? Ich glaube, die hat nur drei Antworten. Ach, dann haben wir da die Antwort vielleicht bekommen, weil wir von oben jetzt drauf geguckt haben. Life on the Seas by Kid. Third and last question. How many battles have we faced until today? Ich weiß, ich habe eben auf 36 geklickt und ich meine, die wären alle zweistellig gewesen. Also klicke ich mal auf 8. Hey, well done. You have the honor of becoming oh. one of Kids Pirates. Among us, there's a pact of mutual friendship and loyalty. You deserve the key to access the hold. Endlich. Oh. Thanks, Captain. I'm honored to be part of your crew. Sorry, Captain. I'll leave you to your business. Good. Go back to your duties, deckhand. Okay, dann können wir zumindest die Sache hoffentlich mit dem Schrank machen. Ich hoffe, das ist der richtige Schlüssel. Und vielleicht finden wir da drin noch irgendwas, womit Perfect. wir die Verkleidung besser machen können. Wow, the legends oh. were true. This is the result of years of piracy in all the seas of the world. Kisten. They will surely be full of doubloons or jewels, but now I have other priorities. Ja, ja. The temptation to examine or take some of those coins is strong, but Dad takes precedence over everything. First, I have to take care of him, and then together we'll study the galley and its treasure. Was sind das hier? Eine Maske. It's a mask. It doesn't seem to come from the Americas. I think it's the loot plundered from the assault on some ship coming from Europe. Mhm. Ah, sag bloß, dass wir das jetzt noch... The temptation to examine or take some of those coins is strong, but Dad takes precedence over ep Ja, 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 das hatten wir schon. Säcke. I'm not interested in taking these coffee beans. I'm already wide awake, especially after finding my dad. Ja, das glaube ich dir. They all have to be dated and cataloged, even if I'd like to dive into it, like in the comic books. It surely contains some spices. They were very precious goods. I don't need it now. Okay, aber ansonsten... Nee, ansonsten können wir ja nichts mehr machen. Dann probieren wir das jetzt mal, ob die Maske eventuell hilft. This gives it an aura of mystery. Mal schauen. What's happening now? I hope it's something important. Diesmal ist es wirklich Morgen. Captain, there's Morgan <coughs> on the bridge. Morgan. Damn scoundrel. You finally came back for the final showdown. It's really you, foul traitor. What nerve you dare show. By returning to the ship you turned your back on after it welcomed you as a child. Prepare yourself to face my wrath. While Dad is busy, I can access the captain's cabin. You won't get far. Oh, ich hoffe, dass der Kelch. Dad has placed the logbook to protect the chalice's contents. Since I'm here, I better take them both. <lacht> das ist auf jeden Fall schon mal gut. Ich ich klicke jetzt the hier. The acrid oh. smell of the mushrooms I saw in the cave emanates from the chalice. This could ah. explain many things. Dad managed to survive all these years on a mixture of water and mushrooms. Even in small quantities, they sustain any organism that feeds on them and provide vital energy. On the other hand, they're also a powerful hallucinogen. Dad's state of shock following his fall from the cliffs, combined with the sight of Kid's ship, made him believe that he was the captain. If he keeps drinking from this chalice, he might never wake up. I have to get rid of this chalice. 
Professor Jones taught us that a strong adrenaline rush will counteract the mushroom's effect. First the chalice and then the adrenaline. One thing at a time. Adrenalin schub, okay. It's the statue of a dragon. It was also Kid's nickname. Other than Scourge of the Seas, he was known as the Sea Dragon for the firepower of his cannons. Better leave it where it is. I don't need it to get Dad out of here. Kid, the Sea Dragon. Ja, ja, ja. Ähm, gut, ansonsten kann man hier Seekarten. These are the nautical charts of the galley. With these, it would be possible to retrace the ship's routes and identify the places it visited. I can't deal with this right now. It's more urgent that Ja, ist okay, ist okay. Dann gehen wir wieder raus. Oh, oh, oh. It's time to end the game. Don't show your face again, Morgan. Look who's back. Henry and his kid, the young Morgan. How did you manage to get here, Steve? It wasn't difficult. I was looking for you all over town, and suddenly, what a stroke of luck. I saw you entering the crypt in the graveyard. I waited for you a long time. Eventually, I decided to enter and I saw the tunnel. Henry, I didn't think you were still alive. I am partly relieved. My regret was consuming me. In the end, you were right. Kid's ship was docked here in Bone Town. How dare you come aboard my ship without permission and offend a member of my crew? Who are you? Henry, don't you recognize me? It's me. Dad, Captain, it's Blackbeard. He was also able to get on board. Blackbeard, yes, I recognize you now. I see that you and Morgan are still inseparable. You'll end up just like him. Henry, not again. You leave me no choice. I understand, Henry. I'm ready. <laughs> On God. Whatever you want, Henry. Um. The day of reckoning. Finally, we'll see who comes out. It's an engaging duel. I could stay here admiring them all day if I didn't have to save my dad and myself too. Wait with it. Let's see if you can handle me. Um. Um. Is Moment, Adrenalin schub. Ad wo war die Kanone? Weil die haben ja gesagt, dass sie die jetzt noch nicht benutzen können. I should have a very valid reason to do something like that. Ah, ist das etwa kein Grund? Äh uh. It's the Adventure Galley's logbook. My first priority is Dad though. Then I can Ja, ist ja gut. It's a metal chalice. Dad uses it to drink. Hm. Here it's written that Dr. Alfred Every I'm curious surely st Ja, was soll ich dann machen? Hier unten ist doch nichts mehr. Why on earth should I leave through this hole? Sollst du nicht. Aber wir müssen noch irgendetwas tun können, dass da jetzt ein Adrenalin oh oder ist das want, schon Adrenalin I can't let you Kann ich ihm das Ding über den Kopf hauen? It's the statue of a dragon. It was also kids name. Other than scourge of better leave it where it is. I don't need it. Ja, toll. Ähm um. Hm. On God. Whatever you want, Hen. Hey, <laughs> können wir die jetzt mitnehmen? It looks like a voodoo doll. Some prankster better not touch it. I wouldn't want its. Mm. I don't think that would work. I don't need it here. Let's see what you can do. On I have to get rid of it so that the mushrooms won't proliferate inside. The day of reckoning. Moment. I have to get rid of it so that the mushrooms won't proliferate inside. Ich muss ihn loswerden. This time you won't get away. Äh, Let's see. Aber den werfe ich jetzt hier nicht durchs Fenster, oder? It should work. It's not a cannonball, so it won't have such a devastating effect. Ah. And now the coup de grace. Fire. Aber setzt das nicht die Pilze frei? I did. Heck, I didn't see that coming. The racket from the cannon was more devastating than the shell itself. Better go back on deck and alert Dad. You don't stand a chance this time. We'll see. I admit it. You defeated me, Henry. A victory over a man who was once a friend has no value for me. Captain, I'm sorry to interrupt your duel, but I think we need to go. The cave is collapsing. Captain, 
what are you talking about? The adrenaline caused by the duels with Jimbo and Steve is reducing the effect of the mushrooms. Hurry, let's go. There's not much time. Not before seeing the treasure. I've never been so close to it, and I have no intention of leaving now. But Steve, not now. There will be other opportunities in the future. Yes, Steve. The kid's right. Let's run while we still can. Henry, do you recognize me? Steve, is that you? Oh, I'm, I'm not sure what's happening. Uh, it feels like I just woke up from a long dream. There's no time, Dad. Let's go. Dad? H how come? Who? You go. I want kids' treasure. It represents my whole life's work. Henry, just know that I didn't want any of this to happen. Steve! Farewell. Dad, let's go! Okay, I'll follow. Ich schlapp machen. Laufen. Die ganze Höhle bricht zusammen. Ein paar Stunden später. Dad, I finally found you. Willie, is that really you? How how long has it been? Ten years, Dad. Ten very long years. Ten years. So this means you received my letter. Yes. But why did you only have it delivered after all this time? Uh, I sensed that something was wrong with Steve. I could see it in his behavior. When I realized that the search for kids' treasure was becoming an obsession, I started to suspect that he could hurt our family. I hid my piece of the map and decided to deal with it. You are a Morgan. You have the spirit of adventure in your blood. But you were only five, and I didn't want to trouble Mom with such a burden. I hoped that in ten years Steve's obsession would vanish. I decided that if anything ever happened to me, you, after turning the necessary age, would be ready to pick up from where I left off. So I sent the post-dated letter. I read Steve's diary. I know you fell off the cliff. How did you survive? A stroke of luck. I fell right into the sea, and the tide pushed me toward an underwater passage that led directly to the cave. I wanted to find a way to get back to the surface, but I had to recover my strength first. The last thing I remember is some really delightful mushrooms. Then, it's all a blank. Dad, let's go back home. We have a lot of things to talk about. Plus, we have to find a way to tell Mom without making her faint. <laughs> yes, we should go back. Ready to leave Bone Town once and for all? Bone Town is not a bad town. As soon as the legal formalities are arranged, we could think about coming back here. Remember, deep inside the cave is still the Adventure Galley. Who knows how much it can still tell the world about the Golden Age of Piracy. Speaking of which, when I took the chalice, I also brought the ship's logbook with me. Here it is. Die Ritter der See. Ja, und das ist das Ende. Ich freue mich gleichermaßen, wie ich auch ein bisschen traurig bin, ehrlich gesagt, weil ich habe es wirklich sehr, sehr genossen. Es war ein richtig, richtig tolles Spiel. Es war auch sehr aufregend. Es hat zwar am Anfang so ein bisschen gestartet, so, ah, wie komme ich jetzt hier raus? Wie kann ich das Fahrrad zusammensuchen und so? Aber das war halt, ja, im Endeffekt die erste Folge. Und danach ging es dann los, oh, da sind Leute hinter mir her und äh, warum sind die hinter mir her und oh, es geht um einen Schatz und das spitze sich dann irgendwie immer mehr zu und ja, es war mir auch nie langweilig zwischendurch, muss ich dazu sagen. Das war richtig, richtig toll, das Spiel, fand ich. Also ich bin ja sehr begeisterter Point-and-Click-Spieler, muss ich sagen. Und ich bin ja auch sehr begeisterter, ja, ich sag mal Detektivspielspieler, wenn man das so sagen kann. Also alles, was jetzt irgendwie so mit äh, Kombinationen zu tun hat oder mit äh, Geschichten, die ich, <lacht> die, ich <irgendwie, lacht> die ich irgendwie entdecken äh, kann oder sowas, das... Finde ich alles total klasse. Und ja, letzten Endes ist das im Prinzip alles so ein bisschen kombiniert hier drin gewesen. Und ich frage mich gerade, warum der Abspann so kurz ist. Nee, aber es kommt doch nichts mehr hinterher. Ich dachte gerade schon, dass jetzt vielleicht doch noch irgendwas kommt, dass die Mutter dann in Ummacht fällt oder sowas, weil er dann zu Hause ist. Wobei, ganz ehrlich, wundern würde es mich nicht. Ja, da wir jetzt aber schon hier im Menü sind, will ich auch gar nicht so lange reden. Zumal äh, die letzte Episode, glaube ich, ziemlich lange ist, die ich jetzt aufgenommen habe. 
Es hat mir auf jeden Fall sehr, sehr großen Spaß gemacht, das Spiel zu spielen, auch wenn es jetzt doch recht kurz war. Aber ich muss dazu sagen, ich persönlich spiele sehr gerne kürzere Spiele. Also jetzt nicht so unbedingt Spiele, die jetzt nach zwei Stunden zu Ende sind oder so. Aber schon so Spiele, die, weiß ich nicht, zehn Folgen haben oder so. Ich denke mal ungefähr, da liegen wir jetzt hier auch. Ja, vielleicht acht Folgen, ich bin mir jetzt nicht sicher. Ich glaube, fünf habe ich schon umgewandelt bisher. Und... Schreibt es mir doch gerne mal in die Kommentare, wie ihr das Spiel fandet, ob ihr die Story gut fandet und ich meine, es ist halt ein Point and Click, ne? da ist man immer so ein bisschen begrenzt, was die Story betrifft, aber ich fand es wirklich toll gemacht und bis auf, dass ich, ich glaube, zwei Sachen insgesamt so ein bisschen übersehen habe, die ich dann erst später durch Zufall gesehen hatte, also wie jetzt zum Beispiel, dass wir den Leuchtturm gar nicht betreten hatten, das war, äh, ja... Ich habe, glaube ich, sogar noch gesagt, als wir das erste Mal zum Zirkus gekommen sind, ach, links geht es auch noch weiter, aber ich gehe erstmal da rein oder so. Und ich denke, dann bin ich weggeportet und habe total vergessen, dass ich da noch weitergehen kann. Und habe sicher zwei oder drei Folgen dann gebraucht, um herauszufinden, dass ich da doch noch hochgehen kann. Und ja, aber ich fand es sehr, sehr toll, dass man äh, nicht so extremst schwierige Rätsel da drin hat, weil... Also schwierig ist immer relativ, aber es gibt halt diese Rätsel, ihr kennt sie sicher auch, wo man sich denkt, warum zur Hölle muss man das mit dem kombinieren, damit ich diese Kombination mit dem anderen dann benutzen kann. Das sind so Sachen, wo man dann gar nicht drauf gekommen ist, weil es einfach total unlogisch ist. Und da muss ich sagen, das habe ich jetzt hier nicht gehabt. Also ja, es war halt nicht so schön mit dem Pferd, ne, mit diesen Bonbon war es, glaube ich. Ähm, aber ich hatte ja schon eine Folge vorher oder zwei Folgen vorher gesagt, ja, nicht, dass wir jetzt das Pferd irgendwie mit Zucker oder mit irgendwas Süßig Süßigkeiten, habe ich, glaube ich, gesagt, bestechen müssen. Aber letzten Endes, äh, ich kann nicht mehr reden, letzten Endes war es dann ja doch so. Und äh, ja, es war auf jeden Fall keine schwierige äh, Lösung, die ich da dann vor mir hatte, deswegen... Okay, lange Rede, kurzer Sinn. Es hat mir sehr, sehr gefallen, das Spiel. Schreibt mir gerne in die Kommentare, was ihr davon ähm, haltet, also wie ihr das Spiel gefunden habt. Und ja, ich freue mich dann im nächsten Let's Play, dass ich euch alle wieder sehen kann. Bis dann. Ciao. Vielen Dank für dein Like. Wenn du mehr davon sehen möchtest, dann darfst du mich auch gerne abonnieren.